Hello, welcome to Dawa CIT. In this session, I'm gonna show you how to send email in SP.NET C Sharp, means the way of mailing process how to work. Let's start first, open up Visual Studio. I have already created a design, see, text to, text subject, text body, and send button. Right? Let's see the design page. Okay. If you don't know how to create a design, if you are the beginners, then you watch my previous video and make sure you can create web design very easily. Now it's done coding behind button. On click. equal create new event right click and viewport try catch exception ex response dot write could not send email ex dot message Now using system dot net using system dot net dot mail right SMTP client 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 is the object of SMTP client ok equal new SMTP client SMTP dot gmail dot com port number 587 see I use here smtp.gmail.com if you are not using like gmail yahoo hotmail etc then you ask from your company they forward you smtp server and port number ok you just change here client dot enable ssl equal true client dot delivery method equal smtp delivery method dot network client dot user default credential equal false client dot credential equal new network credential
type your email id at the rate gmail dot com and type your password okay mail message object name equal new mail message dot to dot add txt to dot text semicolon see this text too is a this text okay If you want to send message your friends, then type here your friends email ID. Not only friends, you also forward to message any company. Okay.
a friend then if you want to show here message like pop up message then script manager dot register startup script this this dot get type pop up a lot message has been sent successfully Save. Now execute. Type in the ID. At the red Gmail. Dot com. How are you? Sent. Okay, pop up message so let's check email ID. Message send it or not. Okay, message send it. Hello friend, how are you? During this email lot of errors show. Now I will tell you very important error case. The first error is could not send email the SMTP server requests a secure connection or the client was not authenticated. The server response was 5.7.0 must issue and client dot enables SSL equal to false. See client is the object of SMTP client and remember enable SSL equal to always to not false otherwise error show. Okay. Let's see how and why errors show come back to visual studio if i change here false instead of true then let's see what will be error show false save type here email id at the rate gmail.com Click on send. Save. Could not send email the SMTP server request a SQL connection or the client was not authenticated. The server response was 5.7.0 must issue. Right? The second error is could not send email the SMTP server requires a secure connection or the client was not authenticated the server's response was 5.5.1 authentication required learn more at wrong email id and password means 
if we put on wrong email id and password then the error show like this other thing that the internet must be connected to your pc ok let's see how and why errors show come back to visual studio type here wrong email id at the rate gmail dot com and password save type email id at the red gmail.com hello friend how are you click on certain let's see what will be error show see error could not send email the SMTP server require a secure connection or the client was not authenticated the server response was 5.5.1 authentication require learn more app so that's reason you remember your email id and password should be matched if you enter a wrong email id and password then the error show like this the last error is could not send email the SMTP server requires a secure connection or the client was not authenticated the server response was 5.5.1 authentication required learn more at less secure app right this was the same error just like a you know where we emerged a wrong email id and password before but here this error is a quite different however if i emerged correct email id and password here but still getting error that means less secure apps is turned off so first you will have to turn on less secure apps if you don't know how to do that then i will tell you it's a very easy and simple way first login your gmail account after login i have given a link here click this link and turn on less secure apps i will tell you one more another process first login your gmail account click here click my account click here scroll down and see hello less secure app off so you have to own here ok updating see google access for less secure apps has been turned on right now sign out after turn on less secure apps let's try to send message again type your email id at the red gmail.com hello friend how are you click on send button message has been sent successfully the next video i will show you how to attach file keep watching the cit i will catch you on next video thank you so much for watching